Aight, it's your boy Mo Safest, the 20 View King. Everything I do, get 20 views. The cop doing what they do is 20 views. Me watching YouTube is 20 views. And I was gonna do I was on my last video where we did a um sadistic, uh what was it? Lazarus. And then Devin the Dude, 20 views popped up. Um, and this is my track, Gotta Be Me. I think I even the first video I did today I started singing up gotta be me and then that video fucked up so y'all not gonna hear me singing. But this is my joint, yo. This is like my theme song. This is my weed smoker theme so I just get high before I leave. Let's check it out. Ain't got gotta, gotta be me. I'm mad, Devin. This is the boy right here. I love Devin, yo. He's a hip hop treasure. That man is singing. I'm not lazy, bitch. Since the day we met, you know I sit around the crib and I blaze a bit. The more I smoke, the higher I get. If there's a new strain, I, I'ma try that shit. If I was out on the streets, I'd have to flee from the laws. So I stay inside the house and smoke weed in my drawers. I always keep some reefer and it's lethal, but the people wanna see for themselves. It's a treat for your health. Yeah, yeah. pass it around. And after you hit it, I roll up another for the third brother, get it. Down the street, round the corner, good marijuana, powerful smell like it's been dipped in ammonia, but no. Hey, hold, 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 hold it down low. Hold it down low. Yo, Devin's a man. Yo, hold down low. Hold down low. Hold down low. <laughs> so Yo, Devin kills his track, though. I used to drink 40 ounces, I ain't gonna lie. I had a nice little two or three year 40 ounce stretch. I could down like one or two of the day. I'm glad I stopped that shit though. That, that, that shit'll kill you. 40 ounces of malt liquor. That shit'll give you heart problems. Heart and liver. You know how we used to do it back in the day. Headaches and hangovers from all that malt liquor. Well, let's go to the store. Nah, that was just the thought, nigga. We can chill right here. I got a whole case, nigga. Light, Light beer. beer. <laughs> better for my stomach. Malt liquor make me vomit. Get uh, weed is all I need. So I'm just chill. Uh, <laughs> it's part for these shit. And I was doing backups. <laughs> That's Blind Rob, Bl not Blind Rob, Blind Rob from the Coffee Brothers. He's also a producer for the Coffee Brothers and Devin. He's like, yeah, and I was doing backups. Blind Rob is nice, yo. He's nice. He's like, he's nice, nice too. A lot of producers are very good rappers, just because like they understand it. Might not be talented rappers, but they're good rappers. Every day, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, baby, I'm gonna smoke every day, yeah, yeah. This is my verse right here. Zoom like the Commodores. Well, of course you know I wish I could take weed everywhere I go But indeed the things that I got to achieve So I just get high before I leave 
That's my joint. That is my bottle. <laughs> High, but of course you know I wish I could take weed everywhere I go But indeed there's things that I need to achieve So, so I, I just get high before I leave. leave He said indeed there's some things that I gotta achieve So I just get high before I leave <laughs> That's real, that's some grown man shit Indeed, just some things that I gotta achieve, so I just get high before I leave. <laughs> Yo, Devin is a musical genius, man. I'm so glad I found Devin the dude. How the fuck did I find Devin the dude? I'm pretty sure Reefer and Beer was my first Devin the dude track. Damn, I would like to know which song was the first song I listened to from Devin. I don't know. I can't place it. It's been, it was so long ago. It might have been a feature. But something sold me on him, and I, I listened like all his shit. I had the ill Devin the Duke catalog. But he, yeah, he is a hip-hop treasure because nobody else does what he do. Nobody else does what Devin does. All right, we're going to edit for the day, though. That was cool. We, we had fun. Yeah, we did a lot of different shit. A lot of different shit. We got Tom McDonald in there again, which I did not expect. <sighs> that shit was um, off-putting. It's it's so weird to know that it's the world thinks so differently. Like there's people that are so convinced that think so differently than you, like opposite of you, and they're convinced as much as you're convinced that they're doing the right thing. Ugh, ugh, I want an island so bad. <laughs> All right, y'all.